We still have showers and a few thunderstorms, mainly south of I-80, so southern Will County heading through Kankakee. And then as we reach into northwest Indiana, Newton and Jasper County, too, a few rumbles of thunder showing up tonight. But the bulk of this activity is sliding through central Illinois and central Indiana along a front that's continuing to push to the south. So as we play it out tonight, here's what we expect. We're going to have a few showers and storms through the night, mainly south of I-80. Here's 3 in the morning. We still are holding that instability there, but by daybreak, we're going to be muggy and mild. So in the morning at about 7 a.m., we'll be hovering close to 70 degrees, and then temperatures will quickly climb as we roll through the day. Now, right around daybreak, fog may be an issue too, dropping visibility, but then quickly it lifts, and we will see a partly sunny sky and push the temperature into the 80s. And I think if you're away from the lake, you could be in the upper 80s in spots, but lakeside, we'll probably pick up a bit of a breeze off the water, and that water temperature hovering at 59 degrees, so it'll be in the 70s right along the lakefront. So 87, sunshine tomorrow. Then on Friday, we bring in a 40% chance of showers and storms. Those probably happening during the midday and early afternoon. That's all tacked on to a front. Now, once the Friday front comes through, we lose the rain chance, and then we build a beautiful weekend. I'm thinking the weekend is going to be sunny, less humid, and very comfortable temperature-wise. Usually, we should be in the mid-70s this time of year, but Jim, and Erica, we're talking right at about 80 degrees, so slightly warmer than normal, but very pleasant. All right. Thank you, Mary Kay.